this is a story about a strange little place where two shapes of paper filled up the whole space. Triangles and squares would all wait in a line to make a home in the same pattern design. Each house like the other, all the same, not a chimney, a shingle, or long window pane. Then one afternoon, after new shapes were made, a snippet showed up in an aqua blue shade. But because Snippet had an oddly shaped top, he looked a bit different from a normal rooftop. He was very shy, but he wanted to play, so he asked the shapes, what are we making today? We make sturdy houses, announced the red square. Odd shapes like you belong in the pile over there. Snippet knew he could build a strong house and be part of a pair, even though he was not like a regular square. Not wanting to argue, he walked over to the pile and noticed his shape had a very special style. They were all snippets. They were just like him. Some sides were long and some sides were slim. He was so excited by such a surprise. There were so many shapes of irregular size. Come on, they all said. Jump right into the pile. So Snippet dove in with a bright, gleaming smile. And even though Snippet really loved the new space, he couldn't forget that strange, tidy place. Deep down in his heart, being divided felt wrong. He just wanted to see all the shapes get along. As he stood thinking, an idea came to mind. What if he went back and tried to be kind? When Snippet arrived, Square started to grumble. Why are you back? You'll make our houses crumble. This was Snippet's big chance to make the Square truly see all the wonderful things they could possibly be. Snippet pointed to the roof's acute angle and said, I could make a tall chimney on that green triangle. Snippet saw Square start to fill up with doubt and he knew it'd be best to act it all out. So he climbed on the triangle and said, how's this look? Square watched carefully, but the house never shook. It's not falling down and it doesn't look bad. In fact, it looks great. So what else can we add? Actually, said Snippet, we could add some more. There's a rectangle snippet for a fancy front door. Is it okay if I ask the pile to play too? Square happily agreed, only expecting a few. But the whole pile showed up to come over and play, and to Square's huge surprise, they had such a fun day. The house they made never looked so grand. It was just as wonderful as Snippet had planned. Squares, triangles, and Snippets all getting along, they'd make a great place where they all could belong. Long rectangles made houses that reached up so high, a pentagon-shaped rocket could fly in the sky. A right triangle made a red sail on a ship, and it was amazing to see such a close partnership. They all learned so much from each other that day that regardless of shape, they could happily play. And to think it's just one Snippet's kind heart that joined them together to make such great art. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this read aloud. Don't forget to subscribe to help out the channel. Hit that bell notification so you never miss a video. And don't forget to check out our Facebook and Instagram pages so that you can see all of our amazing adventures and also check out some of our in-person and virtual classes. Thanks for watching. Bye, explorers.